I'm she who cannot be named. I skate with the Rocky Mountain Roller Girls from Denver, Colorado. Derby Nerd here with Shihu post bout. Uh, congratulations on a tough victory. Was that victory tougher Thank than you, you thought it was going to be? Yeah, it did start out a little bit. We had to make some adjustments for sure. Um, we did play Charm City back in June, so we were familiar with the style of play that they like to do. Um, however, they did bring it way harder than when we played them then. Um, when we went into the locker room at halftime, we kind of had a come to Jesus moment and got our bench together, got our heads back in the game. And uh, that's when we started playing our game and started uh, pulling away. So, yeah. Now, now, they played last night and you guys didn't. Was there a little bit of that there, fresh and ready to go? Or? Um, I, I'm sure that that had something to do with it. Um, you know, they had one game down already. So, yeah, of course, it's physically tiring. Um, but sometimes having that bye is dis disadvantageous because you're not kind of in that zone yet already where you're a little physically beat down, but you're mentally ready to go and you're there. So, yeah. Now, you guys have maybe more of a target on your backs uh, this year than you have in the past. The Western champions ranked number one by DNN. Absolutely. Uh, are you guys feeling that pressure? Uh or are you walking with a little more of a swagger, maybe? We do feel that pressure, there's no doubt about it. However, we're just trying to enjoy the moment, because like anything else in Derby, it changes so quickly that, you know, you have to just take it for what it is and just go with it right then and there, because you never know what's going to happen. Now, you guys have come a long way in two years, I think. Uh, what's been the key of that, uh, that quick development from, I think, eight, ranked eighth of the regionals last year and then all yes. the way now to first? So. Well, it's no secret that we've added a bunch of talent to our roster. However, people tend to forget that, yes, we have those good players now that can be game changers, but we have to practice against those girls. So that brings everybody's level up. There's no doubt about that. I don't like jamming against Durant. You know, there's... That, it, all, it forces everybody in our league from our most seasoned vet to our newest noob to work that much harder, which is a good thing in the end. Now looking forward, semifinal bout against Gotham. Yes. Uh, I think that there, this is going to be an epic bout for sure. Uh, how do you guys prepare for a team like Gotham? You just stick with your game plan? Do you make some adjustments for uh, their particular style? Yes, we stick with our game plan, but you know, I'm not going to lie, we do try to prepare ourselves for what they're going to do and make adjustments accordingly. And, this past year, we've been a team that's pretty good at adjusting to what the other team is doing, so hopefully we can get through that next 60 minutes and call it a W. Do you guys look forward at all, or are you just focused on the semifinal? You guys looking into the finals already? Well, we're focused on this next game, and then we'll worry about the next game after that. So. Well, thanks so much for your time, and good luck. Sure, you're welcome. Thanks for having me.